nine best manifestation tools for blowing up your business. Here are all of the best manifestation tools that I use regularly, which have specifically helped me to supercharge my business growth. Have you ever taken a business course or read a business book or followed some kind of business strategy and not gotten any results from it whatsoever? I literally spent years of my business taking course after course, changing my entire business model and following the latest business strategy only to get no results whatsoever. And it is so disappointing when you work so hard and you put so much effort into your business to not see any increase in your business as a result. And I was tearing my hair out until I finally discovered what was actually holding me back from success with my business. It was my mindset and in particular, my belief systems. I just didn't believe enough in my business or myself to get the result that I wanted to get. When you don't have a strong belief that your business is going to succeed, you can convince yourself that working hard is the answer and that it will solve all your problems, but sadly it rarely does. What needs to change in reality is your belief system and here's where manifestation techniques come in. Manifestation practices are really designed to help you create a rock solid belief system that will see you through from success to success. And once you get your belief system sorted, any business strategy will work well for you or the business strategy that you feel aligned to and called to will work the best for you. As soon as I started to implement manifestation techniques in my business, my passive business that I was no longer working on doubled in revenue in just one month. And since then, my belief system has been so unshakable that nothing is holding me back. And it's not to say that I haven't been tested. I have definitely been tested in my business. And still, I have remained convinced that this is exactly what I'm meant to be doing and I've enjoyed my business so much more as a result. Today, I'm sharing my favorite manifestation tools that I use for blowing up my business. And we are just in the process of moving house, so that's why my sofa that's usually behind me is gone. I've given it to charity because we're moving into a townhouse and we won't be able to get it up the stairs. So that's why the room is in a bit of a state because literally in a few days we are moving into my dream waterfront sea view beach house and I can't wait. So I'm just creating one more piece of content for this month and then after that the next backdrop that you see will be in my new house, probably in my new office and I will be so glad to be back in an office again because in this rental I have not had my own office and I absolutely love having my own office so I can't wait to share how all that went with you in the future. So today you will discover why manifestation is critical to the success of your business and will outperform any strategy you implement and the manifestation tools that I personally use for blowing up my business. My name is Kath Kyle and I lead the Hustle Less Manifest More movement. I help creators, change makers, and open-minded business owners manifest business success through spirituality, self-belief, and strategy. And I help you master your marketing, manifestation, and money mindset. Have you ever struggled to get results after implementing a strategy in a course? Or have you been working really hard, but you've yet to see results for all of the efforts you've been putting in? I would love to hear what your story is and what you're struggling with. And I'd also love to know what you think of my content and whether or not you have any questions for me that I could answer or answer in a future content piece. Let me know by leaving me a comment on my blog, YouTube channel, or sending me a DM on Instagram at Kath underscore Kyle. And just to remind you that I create three content pieces in one, a podcast, podcast, a video and a blog post so you can consume the media that you enjoy the best. So here are my nine best manifestation tools for blowing up your business. And I use a lot of manifestation tools in my business, so I can't go into all of them now, 
but these are my favorites and the ones that I feel are most important to the success of my business. And you can find all of the tools in my business manifestation toolkit. And I keep that up to date with all of my latest tools. Everything that I'm currently doing, I put in that toolkit. So here is a summary of my favorite tools. Number one, reading my goals daily. Each morning I read my stamp statement and a stamp statement is a declaration of my 3G goals. My gratitude goals, which is what I want to manifest, my giving goals, which is what I want to create to sell, and my growing goals, which is how I want to grow to be the most successful version of myself that I can be. This statement also helps me to manifest what I want as it is written in such a way that it helps you step into the version of yourself who already has what you want. Number two, my manifestation journal. Every morning I write a list of my current desires and what I want to manifest and this helps me get clear on what I am creating. I have a manifestation journal that I use for this purpose and in this journal I start a new page and I date the page and I give it the title intentions. By calling this list intentions this gives me more ownership over what I am intending happens in my life. Number three, scripting. Each day and also once a month I do a practice called scripting which means I write out exactly what I want to happen as if it's already happened. Scripting is a very powerful manifestation tool that I use every single day to attract a lot of success into my business and my life in general. When I first started scripting, I had no idea it was about to change my life in such a massive way and it totally transformed my life. And I got to create the life of my dreams, which is what I am now living. And that's why I'm such a fan of this technique. Scripting works by convincing the brain that your script has already happened because you have created new memories and attached feelings to them and the brain has no way of knowing that this isn't real and it creates the reality that you have scripted. And you can hear how scripting changed my life and gave me my dream life by going to the blog post and clicking the link and looking at the content piece called how to use scripting for success in your business. Number four, success rituals. Business success only manifests when we co-create with the universe. Our morning and evening spiritual routines help us to let go and let God, but we need to let the divine play its part and create what we are not able to. But co-creation means you also have to play your part too. You have to take action towards your desires. Taking action means you listen to your intuition and follow your heart when it comes to what you want to do and the kind of business you want to create. The best way to work from alignment is to look at your long-term goals and to decide which habits you could implement each day to move yourself closer to that long-term vision. Success rituals are a set of habits that are repeated over and over again to achieve success. These tasks should make up the bulk of the action that you take during your working day on your business. I personally currently spend about three hours a day on action that leads directly to my goals and sometimes an extra hour for admin tasks on top of that. So when you've decided what you are going to sell and how you are going to market your product, you need to set yourself up for success with action-based habits. Success rituals are groups of habits. They are a system of action steps that you take over and over again to achieve your goals. These are repeatable routines that you follow on a regular basis to practice consistency towards the things that matter the most in your business. All success rituals are made up of numerous habits to form part of a system. For example, choosing titles, creating an outline, doing some research, creating a blog post, creating a call to action, finding images. These are all habits that you do every time you do the task called creating a new blog post. And if you put these all together, you create a ritual that you might call blogging. And if you do blogging as part of your business model, then blogging is a success ritual that you would perform on a regular basis. Number five, journaling prompts. The activity that I do next has been life changing for me. Every day I go through and answer a series of nine questions every single day and 
all nine questions are immensely powerful. I have created a daily stamp journal that has all nine journaling questions as part of the journal. I have tested and tweaked so many different questions and all of these prompts are the most game changing I have ever found and have propelled my business mindset to a new level. And I created a whole content piece dedicated to this journal. So you can go and check that out by clicking on the link in the blog post and it's called how I use my daily stamp journal for business elevation. Number six, stamp it out process to reject disbelief. If I've noticed that I seem to ha be having a very strong negative belief that's stopping me from achieving my goals, I get my journal out and I take the negative belief through a process that I call my disbelief. Disbelief will always stop you from achieving your goals. So you need to focus on letting your disbelief go as a matter of priority. Have you ever heard of the placebo effect? It has been scientifically proven that people can heal themselves just by changing their beliefs. And the opposite is also true. People do harm themselves, cause sickness in their bodies and other problems in their lives by thinking negative thoughts. You will get exactly what you think you are going to get. So from a spiritual perspective, we are all perfect, successful and happy. And then we develop beliefs that are simply not true. These are lies. We have disbelief that we are successful and happy. What we need to do is to remove the disbelief so that we can get back to our true selves. All too often I hear people say, just let go of your limiting beliefs and you'll achieve your goals. But a statement like this can leave people in the dark. So how does one let go of their limiting beliefs when they are so ingrained in their thinking from decades of repetition? How many times a day do you tell yourself a negative thought? It could literally be thousands. How do you even begin to overcome a thought so powerful as this one? And you can actually tackle this problem. You can reject your disbelief. I have successfully changed a lot of my negative thoughts and overcome my own disbelief in many areas of my life. And it took me a while to figure this out. And now I have the process nailed and I have put this process inside my business manifestation toolkit. Number seven, brain stamps. Brain stamps are positive affirmations that stamp your chosen reality into your brain. And this does happen literally. This physically creates new neural pathways in the brain. So it is a very important activity to decide what you want and change your belief systems by using brain stamps. I use at least one brain stamp every single day. And sometimes I write pages upon pages of different brain stamps. Number eight, business planning. At the end of every month, I take some time to plan my business success manifestations for the following month. Planning my manifestations is my secret weapon when it comes to rapidly growing my business every month. All planning is, is just making a decision. It is simply deciding what you want. Manifestation always starts with deciding what you want. If you don't decide what you want, things will never improve for you. And you can see an example of me walking you through my monthly planning process by clicking the link within the blog post. Number nine, business reflection. At the start of a new month, I spend one day logging my results from the previous month and doing my finances. I calculate all of my expenses, revenue and profit from the previous month. I then move on to a fun task that I really look forward to called my monthly stamp reflection. And this is like a manifestation report where I go over my goals to see what I've achieved and I do my manifestation boards at the same time. Every month I share my own manifestation report publicly on my blog, my YouTube channel and my podcast. So go over there and look for the manifestation report and you will see the latest one on there. 
One of my biggest secrets to success is to set up regular routines called success rituals for performing manifestation techniques that I use to, to manifest business success. And so many people ask me how to set up success rituals for business manifestation that don't end up being overwhelming and don't take very long to do. And I have created a business manifestation toolkit where I share all of the tools that you need for manifesting business success. And these easily slot into your everyday life. And this toolkit includes all of the tools, techniques, and routines that I use to consistently manifest success in my business. And you can get that by going to kathkyle.com forward slash manifestation toolkit. And make sure you don't miss my next podcast episode by subscribing to my podcast, Manifest Business Success. And I'll also remind you via email if you are subscribed to my email list and you can subscribe to my email list by opting into any of my free gifts, such as my free Manifestation Milestones board pack. And from this one pack, you can create both a vision board and an achievement board to help you feel good about what you've already achieved and manifest even more. And you can get that by going to kathkyle.com forward slash milestones. And now it's your turn to go and put your stamp on the world.